the hawk and the hummingbird. There once was a hawk who lived in a forest. He was very proud of his strength and speed. He thought he was the best hunter in the world. He looked down on all the other birds, especially the small and weak ones. One day, he saw a hummingbird flying among the flowers. He decided to catch it and eat it. He thought it would be an easy prey. He swooped down from the sky and chased the hummingbird. But the hummingbird was very fast and agile. He dodged and darted among the flowers, avoiding the hawk's claws. The hawk grew angry and frustrated. He tried harder and harder to catch the hummingbird, but he couldn't. He wasted his energy and time while the hummingbird flew away. The hawk felt humiliated and ashamed. He realized that he had underestimated the hummingbird. He realized that he was not the best hunter in the world. He realized that he had been arrogant and rude. He decided to apologize to the hummingbird and ask for his forgiveness. He flew to the flower where the hummingbird was resting. Hello, little bird, he said. I'm sorry for trying to catch you and eat you. I was wrong to do that. You are a very clever and brave bird. You have taught me a lesson about humility and kindness. Can you please forgive me? The hummingbird looked at the hawk with surprise and curiosity. He saw that the hawk was sincere and remorseful. He saw that the hawk had changed his attitude and behavior. He decided to forgive the hawk and accept his apology. He flew to the hawk's wing and perched on it. Hello, big bird, he said. I forgive you for trying to catch me and eat you. I'm glad you've learned your lesson. You are a very strong and fast bird. You have shown me a lesson about courage and honesty. Can we be friends? The hawk smiled and nodded. He felt happy and relieved. He realized that he had made a new friend. They flew together in the sky, enjoying each other's company. They realized that size doesn't matter as long as you have respect and love for each other. They realized that this was the best day ever. <laughs>